hi guys welcome back to my channel today i'll be showing you how to fill and submit a tax information form if you're a non-us content creator so first i am going to go to google and search for google adsense login I am going to log in my email and my password and it will lead me to this page, the Google AdSense page. At the top there will be an information pop-up box so that will highlight you to manage your tax information. Now it says that check if additional tax information is required from you all youtube creators and partners are required to submit tax information to ensure any applicable taxes on your payments are accurate now i am going to click on the option add tax information now i am going to submit my email and password and I'm going to begin to complete this form. The first question is what type of account is my account, which is an individual account. I am going to continue with the next question. Are you a citizen or resident of the United States? No. So I'm going to select no. I'm going to select the option that says this form is most commonly used by non-US individuals. Now I am going to click on start to complete the form. Now I am going to click on the option country or region and select the region I am from. I am from Jamaica so I'm going to select that option. Now moving on to the next question, to insert a taxpayer identification number. Now this section is optional, you choose whether or not you want to input your tax identification number. However, in Jamaica, we use a TRN. Now I'm going to click on next and I'm going to move on to step number two. Now this is where I am going to insert my address and my email address as well. So I'm going to insert those information and then click on next. Now that I have completed step number two, I am going to move on to step number three. Step number three has to do with the tax treaty. Now it is asking are you claiming to reduce rate which is the tax rate. I am going to select yes. Now that I have clicked on yes I am going to select the region country. Now I am in Jamaica so I am going to scroll down and select Jamaica. I'm going to scroll down to the section of special rates and condition. Now, I am going to select all the figures with the smallest rate. So for services, I am going to click on article and paragraph. 
and click on article 7 and paragraph 1 I am going to click on the option 0% so that's the option that I am going to select now I am going to agree by ticking the box now motion pictures and TV royalty now I'm going to do the same thing select article 12 paragraph 2 choose the lowest tax rate and I'm going to click on also other copyright royalty select article 12 and paragraph 2 choose the lowest tax rate which is 10% and I'm going to tick the box to agree to the terms and I am going to click on next now I am going to move on to step number four which is to pre document preview for step number four, I have to confirm that all the information is correct. So you have to stick that box and then I am going to click on next. And what you realize the document is at the side. You can just stop on it to preview all the information to see if it's correct before moving on to step number five, which is the certification. Alright, now in step number five, you have to sign your legal name to confirm that all the information that was mentioned above is true. Now I am going to type in my full legal name. After typing my name, I am going to read the next question. Are you the person listed in the signature section? No, I am going to say yes, I am the person listed in the signature section. And no, after that, I am going to select next, which leads us to step number six. Activities and services performed in the U.S. Now, as the individual or entity identified in the tax identity section perform any activities and service in the US, I am going to click on no because I have not conducted any activity. And I am also going to click the box to certify that the service provided to Google or its affiliate is strictly outside the US. The next question asks, are you providing tax information for a new or existing payment profile? I am providing tax information for a payment profile that hasn't received payment as yet. Now that I submit my tax information, I will receive an email confirming that it is approved and you will also see this information on your screen you can also resubmit a new tax information form so yes guys that's basically it on how to submit a tax information form if you're a non-us citizen if you guys find this video helpful leave a comment down below and let me know don't forget to like this video subscribe if you're new until next time stay safe